Okie Breads and Cookie, welcome to the Brojo Cup, the number 100 Brojo Cup of the world! Let's go! And first match is going to be none other than Mugi versus Tigure. Tigure rocking that mean Potemkin versus Mugi, who is rocking that mean Nagori Yuki. Brojo High ni DDS the player ga Axel shoochu shite imasu. Ah, so nasu ka? みさんこんばんは。あ、えっと、ミスターヤンズ、あれ、ミスヤンヤンズヤンさん、フォローしていただきありがとうございます。ランスロットさんこんばんは。え、で、thank you very much for the follow liquid serves. Liquid serves, えっと、フォローしていただきありがとうございます。トーナメントが悪いよ。ですよね、トーナメントが私じゃなくて。はじめまして、タッチョさん、今日はよろしくお願いします。で、カフィンさん、let's <笑><笑> <私じゃなくて。笑> go. And also, just as I finished talking, Nagori Mugi just uh, took the first round in a very convincing fashion and is currently bringing the heat to Tigure in the corner. But Tigure making a good job of just getting out of said corner and ah, getting a big mega fist on the nose of Nagori Yuki right now. He should be able to get the wall break. And yes, he will. Oh, I oh wow, in the wake up of a drive by Nagori Yuki, not enough to go. Yeah, it's not enough to kill, obviously. Yo, Hakuma, how are you doing? Yeah, well, Brojo number 100, yo. Thanks, man. Much appreciated, yo. Definitely gonna keep uh, doing it, man. Thanks, man. Much appreciated. And here we go. And the Roman cancel for the kill. First match goes to Mugi. As expected. So let's see if uh, Tegure can bring it back. We shall see in a small moment. So sorry, guys. I still need to check left or right if everything is going well. It seems like it is the case, so it's perfect. And here we go with uh, the corner pressure from Mugi, going with the 6P, going with the two, 2K right there, the record gets the underground 6H again. I'll be there for number exactly, man. And it, you can be sure I'm gonna get to that, to that number eventually. Tegre though getting perfected right there, that must have stung a lot. Let's see if... Ooh, and the big wild roaming cancel right there from Tegure. Unfortunately for Mugi, he drops that 6 HS and gets Potemkin busted. There we go with the... Oh, the white roaming cancel again from Tegure. He's got the corner positioning. Goes for the pot buster again for the kill. Good stuff from Tegure. Bringing it back. Currently one round apiece. Let's see if he can manage to take it. Okay, nice patient from Mugi. Just going for a block. Gonna get that wall break. Thanks to the 6 HS. Sweet, sweet. Ooh, that grab though, that punish from Tegre. Very nicely done. Goes for the back Mega Fist. Unfortunately, gets caught by the Mugi. Uh, by the Nagoriki standing S. Also got opened up with the Roman Cancel right there. Here we go with the close S into the Wild Assault. And it's mix time. Ooh, and that was such an unfortunate. Pattern for Tegra Tegra using the ooh the wild reversal. Let's see how we Ooh Lord! That was a big Roman castle. Nice back dash from Tegra. Not out of this yet. Oh no, he tried to go for the snaps. The snappy snoops. Fully charged dust and it definitely did not pay it up. Ah, that was so unfortunate from Tegra. He had to he had to try it out, you know? He had to try it out. I feel like it's it's okay. I feel like it's um it's understandable. I would have probably tried the same eventually. But yeah, man, uh, good stuff from Tigre. Still alive. Let's see how this pans out. One second, guys. And boom, with the Wild Assault again from Tigre. Gonna go for the Prod Mega Fist for the kill. Definitely not out of this yet. He does need, though, to be careful. He is currently down. Uh, two matches, so he needs to meet uh, to do a hell of a big comeback in order to well to uh, see in the winner side of the bracket. Unfortunately for him, he gets ah uh, he gets bitten right there. And here we go with the grab, Mugi trying to go a little bit too deep, a little bit too far, getting oh lord. And here we go with the Garuda impact pressure in the corner. Mugi wants out. You can see it. Ooh, wow, that was a uh, timely uh whiff punish uh a whiff on the grab attempt from tigre okay nice slider head right there tigre on the verge of taking it of taking one map and he actually succeeded in doing so putting one on the board finally let's see how this pins out hmm okie dokie breads and cookie next up what is gonna happen we shall see and here we go with the close-up pressure for a moogie 
Oh lord, this is gonna hurt. Big stuff from Mugi. Ooh, trying to get the the jump in. And here we go with the close-up pressure. Very nice back dash from Tegre. Still gets me that wild wild assault. White wild assault. Also guard crush. I know, man. It does everything. It, it cooks for you as well. It cleans your house, man. It freaking it, it it bathes your your children as well, man. It takes them to school as well. Crazy, man. White wild assault does everything for you. <laughs> it's crazy, bro. Hey, look at that. That was the craziest wild reversal I've ever seen. Good stuff from Moogie. Oh, no! But still gets the kill with... Uh, I, su I suppose it was a uh, chip damage, right? A uh, chip kill. Anyways, that being said, we go with Moogie going completely ham with the Fukio as always. We go with the close S and the 6HS. Oh, TJ unfortunately missed time. TUHS right there from Moogie gets um, picked up by Tigre. Okay, nice guard on the slider head. Mugi gets the far chest to jump in. Goes for the close-up presser. Wants that close S. Tigre not biting. And Tigre fighting the opening with the 2D. Gonna get a pretty nice combo, all things uh, considered. Even a nice corner carry. Yeah, but is that gonna hit? It is. Oh, no! Ooh, that was a lucky trade for Mugi. It would have spelled what? Well, that being said, Mugi did have like a second bar in order to make it safe. That being said, though, Tigran, pretty dire straight. Ah, Mugi finding the opening and should get the kill with the 6 HS. 6 HS kill it is. And Mugi versus Tatcho. And Tatcho also, we have a lot of pot representation tonight. Let's see how this spins out. I love me seeing some pot gameplay, so it's actually perfect. It is perfect to see this tonight. Tigre was actually pretty strong as well. So let's see how Tatcho uh, ends up ends up faring against caffeine caffeine one of the strongest jacko in japan currently definitely there is a there is a onslaught of a very strong jacko players in japan if you watch the brojo cup you know exactly what i'm going to refer to but we do have uh caffeine we have hagiara we have migu migu we have uh, nidaime we have a lot of very strong jacko players in japan and uh, caffeine is definitely not uh, is definitely part of uh, of this uh, of this conglomerate, if I might say, of very very strong jackal players. And here we go with caffeine going for the cross up, and the juggle should be able to get the kill with the forever illusion driver. Oh no, he doesn't get the kill. You don't want to let Pot alive. And no, you hit the shit. No, no. Tacho dropping it, you hit the shit! Oh lord, and he gets killed by the pesky minion, you hit the shit! But it's still fine! Tacho had the win right there, unfortunately he did not do the pot buster in order to punish the, uh, the burst that Caffeine actually did. And he did actually block it, but did not go with an easy solution of just doing the pot buster, man. The, oh yeah, yeah, yeah. The, the command grab is guaranteed, it is, it is. Especially on a blue Roman cancel, of course, yeah, it is. But I think he tried to go for something else. He went for the, uh, the, the, how do you call it? The tackle. And the tackle, it does have a little bit of a startup. So by the time he reached Caffeine, unfortunately, Caffeine was, was already blocking. Yeah, which is really unfortunate. He should have gotten the kill right there. Oh, that was an unfortunately timed uh, wild reversal and straight cancel into the Elysian tri Triver. Good stuff from Caffeine. Taking it with the perfect the second time around, though. This is really unfortunate. Let's see how this pans out. And uh, Tacho sticking to his guns. Let's see if he is capable of taking it. Big jump in though from Cafe. Already setting up uh, the game with the minions. Definitely trying to ooh, pin away at the tension bar of Tacho and all the while taking him into the corner. And here we go. Wow, nice juggle. I think that Caffeine didn't believe that it would connect. Actually, that's the reason why he didn't continue uh, the combo. But still, he's gonna get the wall break using the Elysian Driver. This is gonna do a lot of damage. This is gonna kill Nerton. Oh, yes, it is. <laughs> With the follow up using the pinion, the pinion, <laughs> using the minion to finish the job. Very nicely done. Yeah, the nerves, maybe. Yeah, I mean, the Brojo Cup is a pretty big tournament after all. <laughs> and it's very nice shimmy, uh, not shimmy, fuzzy from Caffeine right there. Don't think that I didn't see the fuzzy there. I actually did. And here we go with the slider head. Tacho getting the hit with the hammerfall. 
And finally, touch of force pop the burst. Definitely wants to keep Cafe in the corner. Last minute, Roman cancel right into the 6p, follow up into the heat knuckle, but Caffeine finds his way out of the corner, gets a ton of juggle right there with a lot of corner carry, and it's back to the schmixes, it's back to the endless jackal pressure in the corner into death. Yet again using a minion, I will not deign to use my hand to dispose of you. <laughs> this is the message of Caffeine using the minion to get the kill and go straight run into the grab again with the grab from caffeine and here we go with another grab caffeine with a message right there you're a command grab character your grabber will let me tell you something my jackal is no short of a grapple uh, a grappler either and i'm gonna make you understand it anyways here we go with caffeine Ooh, that wild assault though a little bit too far to reach caffeine and here we go with the jump in, Caffeine trying to get one hit in, just hitting multiple jumping out, and right there with the Illusion Driver should be able to get the kill with the wall break, ooh, too far, and again, Caffeine using the RC for an extension in order to get the kill, very nicely done. And we lord, Caffeine definitely knew this, Ground Start Hammerfall does not work with the 2D, 2, uh, 2K 2D. And Caffeine looking pretty swell, not gonna lie. He did look a little bit uh, rocky on the uh, on the first round, but everything else has been pristine gameplay from Caffeine. Let's see if he can keep it up. And things are looking pretty swell. Ooh, that big jump in though from Tachiro. Caffeine popping the bridge just in case. Ooh, oh no, that was an unfortunately flying pot right there. Elysian. Driver! Not enough to kill. Does have the corner carry though. Ooh. Oh, big hammer fall, but oh, caffeine with the confirm, and this is definitely kill. How many uh, illusion driver can you uh, do in? Let me see how this pans out. すぐ落とされるやつですね。えっと昨日の大会もありました。あ、そうそうなんすか。えマジか。いやまたちょっとえっとアクさんに頑張ってもらわないといけないんですよね。なんか新しい。えっ、ー、とパッチとかを早く配信していただきたいかと。まあ、とりあえず、we finally made it. It's gonna be Hagiara versus Amato. Let's see how this pans out. Hagiara, one of the strongest Jacko player in Japan currently. Ooh, did a big 6P right there. Yuyama Amato uh, wasn't able to get the corner. Uh, the wall break, I'm sorry. Anyways, here we go with Amato finding the opening forces. Hagiara to pop the burst, goes for the TP, gets the air grab, and goes for the overhead, but nice block from Hagiara. I got not afraid to move straight forward. Gets the juggle. Should be able to get the wall break. Nope. No wall break. But does get the corner pressure. And it's time to oh, get hit by a tab dust. Good stuff from Hagada. Takes the first round. Let's see how this spins out. Second round. Big 6P from Hagada. Getting the corner pressure and carry uh, from Amato. Oh, finds the opening. Forces Amato to pop the burst. But the hammer is here to protect its wielder. Amato with the trumpet calling the cavalry. Gets the corner carry. Goes for the overhead. But Hagiara was quick enough to not get hit by it. And here we go with the minion pressure. Amato trying not to get hit by the cavalry and successfully not uh, successfully doing so. And here we go with the corner. Big closest and this should be dead. Good stuff from Amato. Takes the second round of this first match. See how this pans out. Oh, Lord. Uh, let me check the rest of the bracket, see if everything is going okay. Uh, yeah, just one second, guys. Just checking left and right if everything is going fine. Should be fine, though. Uh, let me check real quick. And yes, we're good. Sorry for the wait. Sorry, sorry, sorry. Oh, here we go. Ooh, big teleport from Amato. Managed to get the first match as well. Amato with one on the board. Doing fantastically good with his Faust. Gets the kill with the close S. Let's see how this pans out. And... 
Okay. <laughs> I I was wondering whether I got I was gonna go for a uh with a um character change, but of course he's not. Very well close is I got going with the freaking call right there with the 2k man. And here we go with Ayala Hamato waking up with the golden burst. Okay, I really need to go get a glass of water. I'll go right after this one. Anyways, here we go. The far S from Hamato gonna get the trumpet. And Ayala is the first one to get it. Ooh, big YRC right there from Hamato. Did, want, did not want to deal with pressure. Nice call out right there from Hagara. Should be able to get the kill. Straight into the Illusion Driver. And this is the kill. Driver! Good stuff from Hagara. I'll be right back, guys. Okie dokie, here we go. And Amato, actually looking pretty good. Gonna get the kill with the spear. And the golf club. Good stuff from Amato. Takes the second round. Let's see who's gonna take that final round. Amato looking very good, actually. I don't think he has a track record of defeating Hagata even once. So it's actually pretty cool if he manages to do so today. We're going to close S, close S. Amato, ooh, does not get hit by the bomb. Quite the contrary. Ooh, Lord, almost got the punish there, but goes for the command grab, and Hagata getting hit by it. Things are looking pretty bad for Hagata, I'm not gonna lie. And here we go with the hammer time. Hagata finally forced to pop the burst. Wow. And here we go, the close-up pressure. I'm about to with the delay. Oh, okay, okay. We're good to go. Ooh. Nope. No bomb for you. And the syringe for the kill. Good stuff from Amato puts another one on the board. Is he gonna 3 0 oh, Hagara? That would be crazy. Not gonna lie. Amato putting a lot of work in this game, by the way. Definitely not your normal run in the mill Faust, not by any means. So, definitely very strong Faust player. Let's see how this spins out. Oops. Somebody contacted me on. On, on, on. Uh, what's it called? Very good. Should be fine, should be fine. Okay, we're good, we're good. Okay, anyways, and here we go. How get it with the back dash? You didn't get caught by the uh, command grab. Now, that being said, it is minion time. Minion time protecting that trumpet with their life. But Amato still managing to take it, actually. Oh, no wake up overdrive. But it is blocked by Hagara. Hagara going straight into the forever illusion driver. <laughs> I make a perfect impression of Jacko. Anyways, here we go with the corner pressure. And Amato with the blocks, bro. You're not gonna open me up that easily, bro. Yeah, you can see I got a fishing for that YRC. Oh, okay, nice block from Hagata as well. Not getting hit by the overhead. That being said, things are looking pretty bleak right there for Hagata. Oh, oh, Lord, I'm about to win that threatening aura, man. Oh, try to go for the teleport. And gets it by the 4H. That did. That, no, it's not the 4H. It's the 4S. Was it? Yeah, probably. There's good stuff from Hagata. Oh, with the 6P, bro. Big closest from Amato, though. Hagata, man, with the pressure, the corner carry. Yeah, now yeah, you're gonna block these, uh, these close S4 ever and ever and ever, bro. Elysia Driver! <laughs> driver! Okay, good stuff from Hagara. Let's see what is going to be the pressure. Okay, nice corner carry. Amato deciding to pop that burst because not wanting to take care, not wanting to uh, have to endure this. Ah, uh, this big, big pressure. Ooh, thankfully for Amato, he did have a tension bar in order to make all of this onslaught safe. Ooh, boom. Overhead, nice blocks from Hagala. Hagala getting hit by the weight. 
Ooh, nice jump out from Agara, getting the punish on the 6p attempt from Amato. Agara finally putting one on the board, though. That was a pretty well done by both. Okay, let's see how this spins out. Duel, whoa! Let's rock and knee. Just one second, yeah. Okay, so. And big, big meteorite right there from Amato. Amato with uh, the bananas. Nice entire using the minion from Hagara. Gonna get that wall break. Boom. Yes, indeed he will. No bar this time to get the Elysian Driver, though. Big jump in from Amato. Oh, and gets challenged by Hagara with the Wake Up Illusion Driver. And gets the kill in the process. Hagara looking pretty good right now, I'm not gonna lie. Definitely working on that comeback. <sighs> nice juggle. Man, and Amato, man, just doing nothing but just block for the past freaking two minutes. So let's see, is Amato gonna be able to... Bring back the heat. Yes, he is. Here we go with the command grab. <coughs> Safe jump. Goes for the fuzzy. Ooh, Lord. And he gets the bait on the burst. That was so well done from Amato. Not enough to get the corner. The wall break. Gets it by 6 speed. No. And Hagiara, man. Ooh, nice bump. A little fuzz is here to play. Ah, man. Oh, wow. What the hell? Nice closest from Amato catches the bag that from Hagara and we are on set point if Amato takes this one. He will take it all and make his way to the semi-finals. Let's see how this spins out. Nice close up pressure right there. Hagara finding the opening. Hagara looking pretty good with the corner positioning. And here we go with the close up pressure. Finds the opening with the 2k. <coughs> Uh, what is gonna happen? Uh, yeah, there is a huge life deficit right there in favor of Hagara. Hagara almost got the kill, by the way, using the minion. Yeah, uh, yeah, and the grab for the kill. The cojones on Hagara with a perfect nevertheless. Damn, that statement, though. There we go. Two matches a piece. Who is gonna take it? We shall see. Ureshine. <laughs> Good stuff from Hagara sticking to his guns. And on to the final match. Let's see who's gonna take it. Okay. Who the closest? Hagara with the 2 k 2 d He's keeping Amato in the corner. Definitely does not want him out of it. And here we go with the wall break. Illusion driver. Big wall break. Here we go the Good lord. Ooh, nice 2k 2d. And Agela should be able to get the kill. And does. Agela on set point with the reverse 3 0 right there. Is Amato going to be sent to the losers? That would be such a heartbreak because Amato was so close to sending Hagara out. Oh, little Faust came here to play. Nice bag dash right there from Hagara. Are you serious? That was sick. Whew. Here we go to 2k 2d. Hagara with the 2d again. Ooh, gets grabbed though. Ooh, this is going to hurt. It's not going to hurt, but you have to... Bear with the pressure, the banana, the banana, banana, glory to the banana. That banana catching, I got a backing off. That was so beautiful. Uh, 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 I think I received a message on Donovan. I don't like it. Did I? And Amato, man, bring it back as well. We are going down to the last round of the last match. Who is going to take it? We shall see. Big confirm from Amato. Not enough to get the corner. The wall break. 
Oh lord! Oh lord! Okay, where's the weight? Ah, oh, the weight is here. Oh lord! Oh, and he still has to hold it. The defense of Hagara has been pristine, getting ooh hit by the freaking instant. Wow, nice air grab. Ah oh, man, and Amato, are you gonna explode there? This is gonna be so unfortunate if it's the case. It's really going down to the wire. Both have equal resources. What is gonna happen? Oh no, too late to get the wig on fire. This is absolutely a heartbreak. But we got the meteorites. Oh no, getting hit by the freak. No, not like this. Amato, not like this. Getting hit by his own weight. You hate to see it. And unfortunately for Amato, I got a move. Servers are going completely crazy. It's impossible to have people enter the room currently but as soon as you did the raid smoib both players were able to enter the room so thank you very much for the good luck uh raid you just did to me man much appreciated okay finally we can get on to the next battle this is the losers bracket Ibushigin Roy versus Amato and uh let me go get a glass of water i'll be well i'll, I'll be I'll, I'll go take one later yeah you're the magical boy smart the magical boy bro on oh, the birthday no way wait wait smart it's your birthday no way really if it's the, if it's the case happy birthday bro much appreciated man big 27 you're still young man that's awesome that's cool man smart much appreciated Happy birthday. I hope you had an awesome birthday uh, stream. And uh, and uh, yeah, thank you again for the raid, man. Much appreciated. That's crazy. And here we go with the wall break. And already... Ooh, Amato getting hit by the gunflame right there. Amato probably going to go... Yep, for the... Wow, that crust under, though. That was so ambiguous. Much appreciated. Wow. <laughs> yeah, man. Boy, the savior, man. The savior of the Brojo Cup. He just saved the Brojo Cup with his good luck charm. Made it so that Roy and Amato were able to enter the private room. Much appreciated to Smoy. And happy birthday to him. No problem. Good shower, bro. And uh, yeah, uh, have a good day, man. Much appreciated again. And here we go with the close-up pressure from Amato. Trying to find an opening reaction from Roy. And Roy delivering said reaction. Here we go with Amato getting the grab. I'm gonna go for the two, the three, yes, actually the 3k. Okay, what's it gonna be? Ooh, that was very, very ambiguous. Amato not enough to kill, though. I'm gonna get the wall break. Mm. And here we go. Ooh, with the close up pressure. Good stuff from Amato. Gets the freaking first match, too. Wow, good stuff. Let's see how this pans out. Is he gonna be able to continue? This a journey! We shall see. And on to the next battle. Let's see how this pans out. Ooh, nice far S right there from Amato. Ah, he's able to maintain the pressure. Okay, Roy. Roy getting countered, unfortunately for him. Ooh, that was a big hit right there for Amato. Nice counter hit. Then we get the, uh, how do you spell? The, uh, the command grab? Ooh, tried to go for a fuzzy, but Roy just let let DDP rip, as always. His signature move. Here we go to close-up pressure. Roy wanting to get a reaction from Amato. Amato sitting still, does not want to work sent. Careful there, the risk gauge of Amato is extremely high right now. And it is gradually going down though. And here we go with the mix, mix, mix for the kill. Amato looking pretty good, yo. Getting the first round of the second match as well. Especially if you take into account he got the first match as well. And on... Ooh, nice bar right there from Amato. Gets the juggle with the bomb. Roy saying, no, I'm not going to give you that replay, that clip. <laughs> I'm not going to give you this. Okay, ooh, okay. Ooh, ah, Roy with the forest counter hit. He's going to do a ton of damage. Not enough to kill, but pretty close though. Let's see how this pans out. Nice teleport right there from Amato. Getting the hit. And woo! Amato getting hit straight in the face by Roy with the closest uh, HS. 
Okay, let's see how this spins it out. Ooh, nice for S from Amato. Come on, comboing into the spear into the golf club. And here we go with Little Faust saving the day. Here we go with the gun flame. Oh, nice freaking check right there from Amato. Even gets the command grab. Trying to bait that DP though. Knowing that Roy absolutely loves this DP. Roy, man. Knowing exactly when to pop that standing K. Ooh, Albert gets clipped by the 3 8 S. Albert got baited. Not enough to kill though. Amato. But still, Amato getting the kill and leading 2 to 1. No, 2 to 0, actually. Yeah, I'm gonna go get a glass of water. Gonna be right back, guys. And here we go with the Fafnir from Roy, getting a lot of mileage right there. And finds the hit with the Forest counter hit. Could be able to get, yep, the killing combo, and does. And on to the next battle. <clears throat> Ooh, Lord. <sighs> Big delayed Bandit Bringer, not punished by Amato, though. Ooh, wow, that was a fortunately timed grab for Amato. Let's see how this pans out. Amato trying to go for the empty low right there. But Roy punishing while uh, blocking accurately. <laughs> Saved by the banana. Amato trying to go twice in a row with the command grab and both whipping. That was really unfortunate. Wow, that was such a nice teleportation. I'm pretty sure it wasn't uh, expected. It wasn't like uh, voluntary, but still great to see. And Amato getting called out for his uh, safe empty jump right there by Roy. Mm. Ooh, Roy catching the back dash should be able to seal the deal and does. Yeah, he does. Okay, Roy taking the first, actually taking the first game, finally. Finally taking a, a game with the afro, by the way. Let's see if Amato uh, can gather his wits and manage to eliminate Roy from the from the tournament, we shall see. Ooh, drop. Big DP from Roy. Eric with the gun flame. And Amato, ooh, getting it by the forest. Definitely in dire switch right there. Wow. Roy, who is going, ooh. Who's gonna have to bear this with this wig? A nice explosion right there. Club Roy off guard. And Amato with the freaking teleport. Ooh, tried to go for another teleport, but fortunately had the cavalry to save his ass. And on to potentially the set point of this match. Big counter hit right there from Roy getting the juggle. Not enough to kill, if not enough to get the wall break. Gets the grab though. Here we go to close-up pressure, big to S counter hit, another counter hit. And here we go with the optimization station, not enough to kill at all, but look at the damage. And here we go! Amato! Oh, not getting the... Ooh, getting hit by the forest though, you hate to see it. And... What is gonna happen? Okay, big cavalry right there, right on top of Roy. Which is definitely not what Amato wanted. Wow, Roy calling out the teleportation of the scarecrow right there. Big grab from Amato, gonna get the side switch. And Amato with the corner pressure. Goes with the extension while the salt in order to keep the pressure on. Gonna get the freaking overhead. Here we go, the grab. Ooh, went with the empty freaking, uh, how do you call it? The uh, empty uh, dive kick. 
Ooh, wow, where did Amato go? Roy did not care. Went straight with the forest. And unfortunately for Amato, this could be death. No, it's not enough, fortunately for him. That being said, Amato does have one full bar of tension. Close to two. Oh, got the overhead. Wow, that was a nice with punish attempt. And the closest for the kill. And Roy not out of this yet at all. Let's see how this pans out. And on to the next battle. Amato getting hit on block by the Fafnir. Goes for the save drop. He's got the corner pressure. Ooh, even, even bait the burst. And big overhead right there from Amato. He's got the corner. Uh, he's got the uh, positive bonus. And Roy going to uh, get the positive bonus himself using the Wild Assault for a guaranteed hard knockdown. Wow. Amato using the overdrive uh startup to make his wake up option safe oh you big bandit bringer Ooh, i'm on the first about the yrc big forest counter it roy definitely ca catching on the rhythm of uh, amato as you can see takes it really clear with a very clean with a perfect and on to the final round. If the one who wins this one wins it all. Big gun flame. Woo! Thank you, the banana. And here we go with the little Faust. Oh, Lord. The freaking defense from Roy getting hit by the command grab, though. This is going to be a save jump. Nope. No save jump. Oh, Lord. That was so ambiguous. And the wake up DP, of course, by Roy. Gets the 2S counter at 2. We're going to jump in. This is going to do a ton of damage. Is that enough to kill? No, not enough. Fortunately for Amato, though, he is going to have to deal with a wake up uh, with the no Kizemit. Wires, here we go. Ah, Amato going for the freaking wild assault. Too far for the grab. Uh, too, uh, too far for the wall break. Woo, nice banana. Oh, Lord. And now the closest for the kill. I'm not thinking that he was safe. I'm so tired of doing this. Good Lord. Oh. Okay, okay, let's go. Mankind knew how freaking hard it was to freaking do a tournament on Guilty Gear Strive. Here we go with the 6P. I got a versus a Bucchini Blade. Let's go. And big first blood drawn by Hagira. But, God, finding the opening, man. It's completed, but my native is Russian, nothing left French. Oh, okay, okay, that's cool. But Russian is <laughs> Russian is way more complicated than French, though. And here we go with the corner pressure from Hagara. Now Hagara trying to find the opening. And here we go with Cal bringing the opening. Oh, Lord! Uh, Kaoru trying to, yeah, keep up with Hagara, but Hagara being very, very filmsy and hard to, to pin down. Getting the corner pressure. Going straight into the Illusion Driver! Driver! This is gonna be death? No! The freaking pixel of death! <laughs> and here we go with Hayara taking the kill with a 2P. Nice and simple. Some, sometimes simple is best. And here we go with Cal. With the corner pressure. Ooh, gets the hit with the close S, man. Jacko and Nago turn. Man, it's crazy. It's crazy. <laughs> We literally had this matchup, like, just the, the match before. But, I'm sorry, man. We've been having so many connection issues today. I'll take any match I can get. I won't complain. <laughs> I'm taking anything I can get right now. Anyways, here we go with the cross up from Haya. Getting the corner position. And baiting the burst. And baiting the YRC, sorry. Getting the big punish with it, too. Okay, what's gonna be next? Here we go, close S. I got a forcing the uh, burst. And I think that Cal is gonna explode. Yes, he is. And here we go with the kill. I got a taking the first match. Very nicely done. 
全部あなたたち、あなたたちのおかげ。Good stuff from I gotta take the first man. But oh, Cal trying to be a little bit greedy right here, trying to get the butt. Couldn't quite get it. And here we go with DMT low. I gotta win the corner pressure again with DMT low. Gets the wall break with the wall assaults. Okay, okay. Ooh, nice. Too far to get the juggle though. And here we go with Cal exploding as always. As he likes it. <laughs> Good stuff from uh, High Get Up. Let's see how this turns out. Okay, look at Red Zen Cookie. Oh, Cal trying to use the uh, the minions as a waypoint to extend his Rick up. Fortunately for him, Hagela was blocking that last one. Okay, no follow up there from Cal. Unfortunately, he is forced to get hit. Nice grab from Cal. Should be able to seal the deal. Ah, he was afraid that Hagela was going to pop the burst. Could have gotten the kill right away, but decided to be a little bit too uh, cautious, I suppose. Fortunately for him, he got grabbed, and again with the explosion, and Hagala using the Wild Assault, the properties of the Wild Assault, in order to uh, erase some part of the burst gauge of uh, of Cal to prevent him from bursting and finishing his meal right afterwards. Very nicely done. Yeah, that was pretty, that was really, really well, well done by Hagala. Anyways, here we go with the closest counter hit. And I gotta go in low. Couldn't quite find the opening. Ooh, nice 2S right there from Cal. And that being said, uh, it's uh, 2 for Hagera right now. <clears throat> here we go, Hagera in the 2K2D. We don't have any music anymore, do we? Oh, we do actually. I'm, I'm bad. Oh, here we go. Yeah. I wanna hear more music. And here we go with Hagala getting that wall break and the puzzle bonus. Managed to block that wild wild uh, that white wild assault. This is the hardest shit to say by the way. That white wild assault. It's super hard to say. And boo, I gotta almost got the kill using the juggle. Yeah, it's grab. You definitely did not want to be in this. Uh, yeah, 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 going ham. That that was the way to go. <laughs> Good stuff from Cal. Takes one round. Let's see if he can uh, take another one. Okay, nice to get to the right there from Agata, gets the knockdown. And I gotta push in Cal ever so slightly in the corner. And gonna get a pretty nice amount of damage right here. Illusion Driver! Tongue Twister, man. Exactly, bro. Exactly. A white wild. White wild. White wild assault. White wild assault, yeah. White wild assault. That's ah, okay. Now that, now that I can visualize it in my head, it's easier. White wild assault, yeah. And here we go with Cal out of the corner. Is he gonna pop? <laughs> That's the real question right there. Wow, look at the damage though. Good lord. Careful there. Careful, careful. Cal, Cal, Cal. <laughs> Cal has been bursting, man. He has been bursting left and right. Might as well say White Wild was shot. White Wild was shot, yeah, for the true trunk twist, exactly. Good lord. Cal has been bursting left and right, man. This man lifts the burst. The pop, the freaking blood burst. Ooh, big Beyblade right there from Cal. I should have made a, um, um, I should have made a prediction of how many times will Cal uh, blood rage <laughs> during this set. Is it gonna be two, three, four? <laughs> Wait. It wouldn't even surprise me if he bursts at this one too. Ah, 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 ah. Okay, here we go. Okay, Cal being reasonable now. Ah, but unfortunately got. Oh lord, almost got the kill, not enough. That being said, he is definitely in chip territory right now. This is gonna be pretty hard for him to... Man, whoa, this is exactly what he needed. One hit is all that is required right now. Ah, he's gonna go ham, he's gonna go ham, he's gonna go ham, he's gonna go ham. And here we go, ham time! Yeah, <laughs> I called it. Okay, Cal put one on the board, finally! Two to one! Let's see how this pans out. Is Cal gonna be able to bring it back? We shall see. One, two, three.
Oh, yeah, sorry for the wait. Oh, Lord, a cow looking pretty good, eh? Ah, oh, but of course he exploded again. Oh, no, you hate to see it. The engine driver. Oh, this is going to do a ton of damage. It's not over because of the blood rage explosion. Station. Oh, oh, that back down. Oh, no, not like this. Oh, shit. Who died? No, no, cow. I, I, he made me dream, like, right, he really literally made me dream right now. I thought he was gonna take it. Ah, ah, Cal being greedy again. Cal exploding. No, it's fine, sir. Let's see how this spins out. Here we go, Hagiara. Getting that hard knockdown. Here we go, the close S. Okay, yeah, Cal trying to get out of the pressure, but it's just, just too much, too overwhelming. And Hagiara getting the kill. Yes, he does. Take it a clean through the nail! Very nicely done. Oh, yokata damasu! Okay, let's go, finally! <laughs> Good lord, it took so long! Ah, oh, that was so freaking long! Oh, I'm so happy! Ah, oh, yokata yatode! <laughs> okay, let's go, this is the winner's final! Mugi versus Cafe, finally a match we can go! Finally a match we can see! I'm gonna go grab a, a, a bottle of water, guys. I'm so thirsty again. Okie dokie, let's go! First match! First, first uh, match in a long time that we have been, that we have been able to see. This is the winner's final! Moogie versus Caffeine. Moogie managed to take the first round. Let's see if Caffeine can bring it back. We shall see. Big, big, big part is countered from Moogie. Ooh, gonna beat that bit! Gonna beat that burst! And gonna get the punish with a perfect. Moogie takes the first match extremely quickly. Not gonna lie. Please make it last. We don't know how many times you're gonna be able to see matches tonight. Please make it last, Moogie. Give me content. <laughs> and we're going Moogie with the confirm. Gonna get a lot of damage right there. Ah, mais enfin, mais carrément, hein. Mon dieu, on en a pris du temps. Je suis vraiment désolé, hein, d'ailleurs. Mais bon, c'est pas de ma faute, c'est les serveurs d'Arxis, ça n'a rien. Ça n'est pas de ma faute. <laughs> mais bon, hein, enfin, on peut enfin, on peut enfin regarder un match, quoi. This is on it. Let's go, Moogie with the wild assault and the confirm as well. Ooh, goes for the six speed. Didn't get the dribble, unfortunately. And here we go with the close up pressure. Moogie chipping away at the life of Caffeine. Caffeine finding the way out of the, the, the corner, though. And here we go with the corner pressure. Caffeine getting the grab. And getting the kill with the Legion Driver. Driver! And the kill it is! Second round goes to Cafe. Let's see how this pans out. One second, guys. Uh, what is this? I get over here. Ah, okay. What do you want? Okay, so more to. Sorry, I'm just uh, checking the bracket just to be sure that everything's going fine. <laughs> and here we go with Caffeine with the Wild Assault getting the kill and puts one on the board as well. We have a tie, ladies and gentlemen. One match apiece. And on to the, the second, the third match, actually. And no, that was a 6p attempt by Mugi. Unfortunately for him, he wasn't able to get the entire Caffeine Wigan with the Gold Burst. Good lord. Ooh. Here we go to close up pressure. Ooh. Caffeine trying to bait that tech attempt from Moogie, but Moogie not biting. And here we go. Ooh, that was a big Beyblade. And this should kill, actually. And not enough. The pixel of life left. Ooh. Here we go. Ooh. And still, still. Caffeine trying to use the Roman cancel right there. 
and just to see what Mui was going to do and did see what he was going to do. Tried to go for the whiff punish, but still, but get whiff punished on his attempt to get whiff punished. That was unfortunate. And we're going Mugi with a lot of damage right there. Already 50% of your life is gone. What are you gonna do? Big 2 HS. Ooh, no entire there. And here we go with Mugi. Mugi with the close up pressure. Using your Roman Castle to extend the pressure. Cafe holding on to their burst. Definitely does not want to let it up. Big 6 P, 6 HS, and this should be it. With a perfect from Mugi. Taking the lead 2 to 1. Caffeine, caffeine definitely not out of this yet. Can definitely make a comeback, but this is an uphill battle. Big Beyblade right there. And Mugi with a 2 HS counter hit. Caffeine forced to pop the burst or else. Here we go to close up pressure. Mugi finding the opening with the Beyblade and going with the bite right after the Roman cancel. This is set point. Let's see if Mugi is going to send Caffeine in the losers. Nice air grab right there from Mugi. And with the Beyblade. Goes for the white uh, the white Roman assault. Uh, assault. Mm -hmm. The white wild assault. Good lord. Hmm. And here we go with the grab from Caffeine. Caffeine going with the grab again. Ah, trying to go for the fuzzy, but kind of messed up his setup right there. Is he gonna go for the fuzzy again? No, goes for a cross up. And gets a confirm into the Roman Cancel into the juggle for the kill. Caffeine, a one round up. And Moogie with the double Fukio landing straight into Caffeine's offense. And Caffeine finding the opening with the 2D counter hit into the Legion Driver. Let's see how this pans out. Mugi first popped up. Roman. The, the burst. Let's see how this pans out. Big 2S counter hit. Caffeine first popped the burst. Wow, what the freaking. Ah, oh, the active frames of this move, though. The active frames on this move. But Caffeine should be able to shield it. No, not enough, but yes, enough. Finally, we are going down to the wire. Last match of the set. Is Mugi gonna be able to send Caffeine to the losers? We shall see. Let's go, Caffeine MD! Oh, big Beyblade right there. Oh, let's see if Caffeine is gonna be able to seal the deal. Mugi using the 6 HS. Yeah, man, exactly. It takes time to uh, decaffeinate to decaffeinate himself. Oh, Caffeine keeping the tent, the pressure real. Gonna get the juggle and the corner carry. No wall break though. Oh, okay, let's see how this spins out. Oh, far as, but yeah, Caffeine holding strong, gets the 2D counter hit. Should be able to get the kill and takes the lead. This is set point. Is Caffeine going to send Mugi to the losers? We shall see. Big 6P right there. Caffeine forces to pop the burst. Had the good idea with the, uh, the guard point, but Mugi was definitely fishing for it. Okay, Mugi also out of burst. The person who gets open there now is gonna have to eat a lot of damage. Ah, too far to get the 2 HS. Caffeine getting the the, the opening. <clears throat> Here we go. We are in zoning town. Ah. Yeah. Okay, no more minions. And it's time for Mugi to make his move. Nice delay for Mugi not wanting the oh, and the grab for the kill! And Caffeine taking it, making his way to the loser, the winner's final. The next battle, Mugi versus Aguiara, this is the loser's final into my show! Good lord! Duel one. one indeed! And this is the loser's final, let, let me go take a freaking glass of water, be right back.
And here we go with the jump in! Bye, I got gets the kill. And Mugi with the corner pressure, trying to get a reaction from Hagera. I got a holding strong. I got a didn't manage to get the first round though, so definitely in the lead. Unfortunately for him, he was forced to pop the burst. And it's on with the minion game. I got up with the six feet. Unfortunately for him, Mugi didn't challenge him whatsoever. And it's this time around, Mugi who tried to instigate the corner pressure, but I got just jumped straight out of it, and rightfully so. Nice six period there from Mugi. Definitely on point with the 6 speed, but I got a checking them Fukios in. And getting the hit also with the jump out of the corner. Oh, nice grab from Hagara. Not enough to kill. And here we go, the second grab for the kill. Very nicely done. Okay, first round goes to. Uh, first match goes to Hagara. And right off the bat, Boogie forced to pop the burst. I get a man doing a good job of just casually getting out of the corner. It's actually pretty impressive. Here we go. I got in the pressure. Boogie having to hold it. And look at the freaking the risk gauge right there. Nice block right there from Boogie again with the block on the top. Uh, ooh, that, ooh. Oh no! Get to see it. The blocks from Mugi have been pristine, man. That's actually pretty crazy. Here we go, the, the, the... Yeah, nice kill on the minion. Big 2S counter hit right there for Mugi. Gets the far chest. Ah, too far to get the closest though. And, ooh, the playoff kicks. You love to see them. Wow, that's serious though. That playoff kick series was pretty crazy. And here we go with the Legion Driver for the wall break. Just want somebody ping me one second, guys. Just want to make sure that every. Ah, okay. I'll be right back, guys. What's it, guys? Okay, we're good. Ah, what am I doing? Okay, sorry for the wait. Had some technical issues, and the technical issues should be gone now. Okay. So, here we go. And Moogie, man. Now getting hit with the playoff kicks yet again. That's a lot of playoff kicks <laughs> in this particular set. Good luck. I feel like I, we just saw this this round like literally a couple of seconds ago. Anyway, here goes the wall break. Moogie, you currently one round down, one game and one round down. So things are definitely looking pretty bleak for him. Not gonna lie. Here we go, the close S. Boogie in the corner, forced to handle all of this pressure. And yeah. Oh, and got freaking baited. Big concert to right at the end to save it all. Very nicely done by Moogie. Found the perfect timing to do so. Uses the clone, gets the jump in. And I get eyes out of burst. He has to. Hold it. Wow, the ri the freaking mixes are real. Is that gonna kill? That's not. Yeah, absolutely not. <laughs> that was gonna do a lot more damage, though. I don't know why. Anyways, here we go with the 2K2D and the 6P, uh, the 6HS for the kill. With a perfect, too. The statement from Moogie. Definitely back on track. Let's see how this is gonna pan out. I get out with... Ooh, the Akuma Fireball goes straight for grab, though. The cojones on this guy. Ooh, big 2k, though. Wow, the range of the 6 h though. And Mugi also trying to get that bite. A sneaky one at it. And the playoff kick is back on track. Oh, too far. 
get the tab dust. Okie dokie. Oh, big 2HS! Too far to get anything, but Moogie. Uh, contents to just close the gap. The distance between him and Hagera. Just so he can actually apply pressure. And a freaking far HS, but unfortunately for him, Hagera had way more health left and could tank it. The one round up for Hagera finds the Abari right there. Gets the jump out as well with the cross up. And uses the Wild Assault in order to secure heavy knockdown. We go to closest. Hagera with the corner pressure. Try. Ooh, gets the freaking tank attempt right there. Straight into the Elysian Driver. This is not gonna kill. Oh, it is gonna kill. My bad. I'm horrible at, the, at these uh, at these <laughs> the predictions, man. Good stuff for Hagera. Got two to one. What is Moogie gonna do? What is Moogie gonna do? And here we go. Potential final match of this set if Moogie doesn't manage to bring it back. Ah, uh, Moogie with the 4S though. Force to pop the burst. Almost got the 2S right in. Gets hit by the playoff kick though. Ooh, nice backdash from Moogie. Gets out of harm away, but does end up hitting the guard point from the minion. That being said, he oh got hit by the air to air from Hagara. Front Fukio, not front Fukio, front Beyblade. And it's the sandwich with the minion. Catches the bag dash using the closest. And here we go back in the corner. I gotta try not to get sniped by the 2S. And rightfully so. Ooh. That could have been an air grab. Ah, not enough to kill. Too far. But so close. Moogie trying to stay alive. Definitely does not want to go on the match point right there. Guess the air grab. Was definitely looking for it too. Okay, Moogie's still alive. See how this spins out. Nice for uh for us. No, not that freaking back dash from Moogie. That was sick. And Moogie getting the hits in. Oh, goes for a delayed Beyblade. Look at the damage though. And again with the delayed Beyblade. Try to catch how get up pressing buttons yet again. And here we go with the, the bite. Are you serious? Not afraid of the wake up. Uh, this is basically it. This is it. Ah, uh, try to bait the uh, the wire C right there from Hagara. Knowing that if he goes ham at that particular moment, Hagara is just gonna wait for him uh, to uh, to be on the verge of blood bursting before YRC. And then he'll be forced to blood burst, and then Hagara would be able to punish him and kill him in the process. That being said, here we go, we are going down to the wire! Last match of this set for sure, the one who takes it makes will make his way to the grand final. Let's see how this spins out. We'll go with the minions. And we are back to the future! <laughs> what? <laughs> anyway, we're back to the playoff kicks. I get out with the corner pressure. Ooh, too, no, Moogie too far for the bite right there. And Moogie a little bit upset right now, as you can see. Ends up hitting the guard point. And ooh, if that juggle would have spelled death. Moogie still, oh, jumping to his death. And we are on match point. Is Hayera going to send Moogie out of the tournament? We shall see. Nice bar for Moogie, not out of this yet. Forcing the burst from Hayera. And Hayera finding the opening. Goes for the close S. Here we go, the close pressure! Boom! Ah, look at the close pressure, good lord! Ooh, nice tab does though, and ooh, ah, Hagera going ham! Yeah, forcing Mugi to pop the YRC though to really get him off of his back. If Mugi does not, yeah, this is death, right? It's not! Mugi, this is death! <laughs> Good stuff from Hagera takes it three. Good lord! Here we go! Good old Jacko! Let's see who is going to take it. Jacko Mirror, the first Jacko Mirror in the history of the Broad Cup, by the way. In the history of a lot of uh, tournaments in Japan, might I say. I don't I don't think we've seen a lot of uh, Jacko Mirrors uh, before. Anyways, that being said. So, 
Uh, caffeine is rocking the green... The green taco, if I'm correct, I'm pretty sure. Yep, it is. Yeah, and Hagel is rocking the, the gray one, I think. Yes, yes I am, yeah. So, I got a rocking the gray, you know what, I should probably put... Uh, uh, nah, I'm, I'm tired. Anyway, there we go! I'm surprised this match hasn't happened sooner. Yeah, I know. Uh, these two always do so. Yeah, I know, right? It's crazy. Now that you think, now that you mention it, I'm actually also surprised it hasn't happened before. Yakomera is fun to play, but I'm not sure if I'd like it in the tournament. Yeah, it must be pretty uh, nerve-wracking to play against a Jacko uh, well, it, it, while playing Jacko in the tournament. Yeah, you got the uh, not only the added uh, parameter of you know pride of fighting against somebody who's using the same character as you, so you definitely don't want to lose. But you also have to take into account the high pressure gameplay of Jacko that you will have to endure during the whole course of the, the set. So yeah, it's actually, it must be pretty nerve wracking playing uh, Jacko Mirror. Yeah. Hmm. Anyways, here we go. And for now, uh, Hagera is up one round. Let's see if Caffeine can actually manage. Ooh, Caffeine getting the bait on the burst. Oh no, Hagira getting the bait on the My bad, my bad. Hagira is up 1 to 0. But you know what, guys? I think we're gonna get a reset. I'm not even I'm not even joking. I'm pretty sure it's gonna be a reset because Hagira usually has the upper hand uh, against Caffeine, so. It has a lot of interaction in mind games if both know how to fight Jacko, yeah. I'm sure, I'm sure it does. And here we go with the grab, Caffeine getting that grab, getting the bait on the the the, the, the tick attack too. And here we go, the minion war is on its own! We've seen these two play against each other a lot, but never in, in Grand Final though. And here we go with the grab, nice tech though! Caffeine trying to get... Well, to get Hagera in the corner, and successfully manages to get the 2D counter hit. Is that not gonna go? Okay, on to the post. Wall break and Caffeine getting the kill with the 2D. It's gonna be the next. Wow, okay, nice. First blood from Caffeine managed to snipe Hagiara out of the air. Oh, nice bar right there. Uh, Hagiara getting the corner positioning and the instigating the pressure. Woo! Caffeine has really been going for the shimmy a lot and it's been really working for him. Let's see how this pans out. Oh, that jump in though. And here we go with the burst from Hagara. Uh, the burst from Caffeine, actually. That, man, I'm, I'm getting confused. <laughs> oh, again with the freaking take a temper right there. And this time around, yeah, it is one round apiece. Both went for the exact same thing. This is pretty funny though. Okay, here we go. Nice Sabari from Hagara. Oh, again, this time around, Habari from Caffeine taking his turn back and trying to bring Hagara in the corner. Hagara with the spacing, with punishing. Caffeine, both using Roman Cancel to go out of harm's way. Jacko 2K and 2D in the mirror are really strong. Oh, yeah. This I can definitely. I can definitely. Uh, Trust your judgment on that, yeah. This I definitely do. Man, but yeah, Jekyll is, seems so fun to play though. And here we go with the wall break. Into the wild assault. Well, from the wild assault, actually. This is gonna be a hard knockdown. I got a baiting. Oh, baiting both the YRC and the burst. I got a with a statement right there, man. Holy freaking lord. From the point of view of Jekyll player, I should have added. Okay, okay, I see. I can, I can definitely get, I can definitely uh, understand that point of view. Good stuff from Hagara, man. Up to the zero. I'm gonna tell you, we're gonna have a reset, guys. I'm telling you right the freak now. From the point of view of a Jacko player, I should have added. Oh. Wait, Jacko? Oh, your messages are... Your message just popped up, like, um, a little bit later, my mineral. I didn't actually see what you posted. Jacko 2K versus other characters feels okay, man. And Jacko 2K versus the mirror. Okay. Feels weird, man. Okay. 
He's really fun, I just wish they didn't nerf her a lot. Yeah, I see. Oh, Lord! And here we go with... Oh, the illusion driver! This is gonna do a lot of damage! Hmm. It's hard to take you seriously when you see two jackals in Grand's character. <laughs> They're great players. They are, they are. Yeah, I'm not gonna lie, these two play really good. Uh, 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 and a delayed burst right there from Gaffey. Yeah, this fans out. <clears throat> oh, Lord. And it is back to the minion freaking zoning. That being said, Aguila both really have a little bit of life left. There's not much room for error now. Oh, Lord. And Aguila getting hit this time around. Caffeine taking the first round. <clears throat> Again, here we go. With the close-up pressure. Uh, uh, but for my my opinion on Jacko, and I think it, it can pretty much translate on the opinion of Japanese uh, uh, Guilty Gear Strive, uh, how do you say, community as well. I think Jacko is actually still considered a pretty strong character, I think. Uh, she was definitely considered top tier in the previous patch, before the nerfs, but right now she's like... Uh, t she's like high... High... High tier... Well, just high tier, basically, I suppose. But yeah, she was definitely considered very, very strong in the previous patch. I think this is part of the reason why they nerfed her so much. Well, so much, why they nerfed her. Uh, right now is because of the opinion of... of, uh, of the, the Japanese community uh, regarding Jacko. Uh, that being said, okay, we are round one round apiece, and Hagera is on the verge of resetting the uh, the bracket. Let's see how this spins out. That being said, Caffeine waking up a bit right now. Definitely doing a lot less errors. Ah, nice use of the minion right there from Caffeine. <clears throat> Uh, I'm no Jacko main, but I call her damn good. Uh, like uh, an A rather than an S plus or S. By GG power standard, that's pretty average. Yeah, I can get by this as, as well. Field was nerfed before low Beyblade. Yeah, man, but the low Beyblade is never going to get is never going to get nerfed. It's it's over. They had all of these seasons to nerf it. They're not gonna nerf it anymore. They're not gonna nerf it. Uh, they even buffed this shit, right? It wasn't low before, no? Now it's low, so yeah. That is completely dumb. Yeah. They buffed the shit out of this freaking move. I hate this move so much. But anyways, it is what it is. But you know what? Uh, Nagoriyuki is okay. Even with the, the buffs that he has right now, I feel he's just okay. Like, I had less problem... I have less problem with uh, Kirin Nagoriyuki than uh, Season... When was he busted? Season 2, was it? And Nago still loses to the nerf Jacko uh, Despair. <laughs> fair enough, fair enough. Mineral, you really don't like Jacko, don't you? Well, I'm one to talk to. I, I don't particularly like the character either, so I'm very biased. But that's because, like, uh, Eno and Jacko is actually pretty damn hard for Eno, in my opinion. Yeah, in my opinion, in my opinion. But I, I'm, yeah, I'm the one to really give an educated uh, guess on the matter. That being said, look at that! And Hagara taking that... R yeah, Eno versus Jacko is pretty good for Jacko. Okay, well, I'm happy that Carrot degrees with me at least. <laughs> I've got that going for me. <laughs> I found Season 2 Nago way harder, but I also main Sin. So, Season 2 Nago way harder, okay. But I mean Sin, who was the same... Yeah, yeah, Sin was garbage at that time. Wait, don't... Uh, I have no grudge against any character. Not even it. Okay, okay, that's cool, that's cool. I personally have an ever-going grudge against AC. When, even if he's nerfed to the ground, I've al I'm always going to hate this character. Because I hate the archetype of this character. I feel like the, po the point and click type of archetype is like, yeah. I just don't like it. And that being said, look at that! I got a resetting! Yeah, yeah, so 3, 2, 1, was it? Yeah, I think. We're going on to the grand finale. Good lord. Hmm. A testament main, I'm a testament main, I play the best character in the game. If I lose, it's my own fault. You? <laughs> is testament the best character in the game though? He has too many HP and he is everywhere in EU Celestial. Okay. And on top, 
That's too much HP and he is everywhere in EU, so you're talking about HC? Happy Chaos? And on top of that, Johnny's really effing good. At least MK... Ah, uh, damn it. This but Millie. Millie, I think, is top tier, though. This is, like, not a very... I think it's not a very famous... Not famous, but a very, um... I think it's a controversial take, maybe? I, I don't really know, but... I really think Millie is actually top tier now. I really think she is. <clears throat> if she's borderline top tier, yeah. I've always had problems with this uh, this character anyways, but yeah. So I'm biased. But I, one thing I don't agree is, is some people tend to say that... What's his name again? Uh, the fat dude... I forget. Um, damn, I haven't played Guilty Gear Strive in one month. I'm forgetting everything. Gold Lewis. Gold Lewis is also top tier, or like god tier in the not god tier, but like he's the number one tier in the in the game. I don't know if it's the truth or not, or I might have skipped on a lot of like Gold Lewis text and shit, because I don't think it's the case, but Johnny is the most down player character uh, character this season. No one in you will doubt that Millie is top tier. People got ran over too often by hardcore. <laughs> He didn't say in the OP, it's just he got treated he gets treated as if he's terrible. Okay, okay. I'll take your words for it. The thing is that uh, I refuse to play Guilty Gear Strive until I get master in Grand Blue Fantasy Versa, so I'm gonna be stuck on Grand Blue for a long time. <laughs> Unfortunately. So yeah, I won't be playing a lot this uh, season, maybe. It depends on my on my swiftness to get master on Grand Blue. But I'm S plus plus right now, so it shouldn't take too long though. Anyways, here we go! Uh, for now, it's a tie! One round apiece! And ooh, that bait on the gold burst that unfortunately cannot be punished anymore. I will de my Melia Fask. Oh boy. Well, from the uh, the vids that you uploaded on Twitter, it seems like she's already de bro. There are worse states to be inclined. Enjoy your time and yeah, yeah. Yeah, I want to enjoy a bit Guilty uh, Grand Blue just to, you know. Take a, a, a little bit of a vacation from Guilty Gear Strive and come back eventually. I'm, I'm definitely coming back on, on Guilty Gear Strive eventually, but I just want to enjoy some Grand Blue time a bit. I really love this game too. Anyways, look at that, man. It's the War of Dominion. The War of the, the people who get rid of Dominion as fast as possible. Nice. Roman cancel right there from Hagera. Ooh, on the verge of taking it too. No sick. And look at that, man. Hagera doing a very good job of dispatching the minions from uh, Caffeine. Definitely a higher pace than Caffeine is doing it right now. Yeah, I've been improving fast, but I'm nowhere near where I'd say I'm comfortable. Yeah, I bet. Yeah, well, you have been playing uh, Jacko for most of the game's lifetime, so... Uh, like, maining somebody else right off the bat is gonna take some time, I think. Well, but it's fine. It should be fine. You're a good player, so... It shouldn't take, take you too long, I think. Anyways, here we go with the uh, minion zoning. And woo, that air grab though from Hagara. Hagara with the corner positioning. Gonna get the illusion driver. <clears throat> I'll jackal mirror neutral. And defend. Yeah, man, it's actually pretty fun to see. I'm not gonna lie. It's fun to, to witness, so it must definitely be fun to, to play. And here we go with. Ooh, yeah. Cafe not popping the burst, and rightfully so. I'm losing my voice, guys. Wow, <clears throat> we need Carrot May uh, arc back. <laughs> what? Carrot, you had a May? Damn, I wasn't aware. Okay, that's good. That's good to know. And <clears throat> here we go on to the next battle. Caffeine. Ah, uh, yeah, doing a little bit. Yeah, it was my first man. Damn, that must have been fun to watch. <laughs> here we go with the grab from Caffeine, trying to push Hagia in the corner. And oh Lord, Caffeine putting that pressure in the corner is doing pretty good. Get the grab, and oh, almost got the tap dust. <laughs> wow, <laughs> that was fun. <laughs> that was a very funny uh, uh, ending screen. Oh, nice two KTD from Caffeine gets the hit. Caffeine getting it by the 2k 2d from I got this time around. Let's grab on the sweet sound of Pepsi Man 2. The nice tap dust from I got gonna get the wall break. Okie dokie. Nice use of the minion from Caffeine. Too far to get anything substantial though. Nice air grab. And the tap dust. 
Unfortunately, could not quite get anything else out of it. I gotta try to go with the wild, the raw wild. Oh lord, yeah. And caffeine finally putting one on the board. Let's see how this pans out. Is caffeine gonna be able to take it? Don't know, man. I see MK, MJ Kurase play, and I'm like, ah, oh, help! I'm scared. Who's insanely gonna help you? Uh, he isn't, he isn't, ah, he isn't insanely OP, it's just he gets treated as if he is terrible. Okay, okay. Got it. Oh, wow, Pepsi Man. <laughs> I know, man. He has one, right? <laughs> and here we go with the 2K 2D. Uh, yeah, the, the 2K, no, that was a standing K2D. Uh, two, yeah. Anyways, here we go, the knockdown. I get up. I in dire straits. Oh, I haven't seen them play. You should. Woo! And that juggle. Caffeine definitely waking up right now. Is he gonna take it? We shall see. Woo! Oh, the 2H though. That did so much damage. That I don't even know where it came from. What was the decision making of, of using 2H right there? That being said, here we go with I gotta trying to wake up right now. Definitely getting thrown out and getting thrown off from the rhythm of caffeine currently. Oh, okay. Oh, Lord. Caffeine. Uh, using the 6 age, trying to catch Hagera in the air. Oh, Lord. And here we go with the tab dust. And this should be enough to kill. Yes, it is. Caffeine taking the lead, yo. Or not. Oh. Uh. Oh, maybe I can do this. Good stuff from Caffeine taking the lead, yo. What is going on? Not many. Arietto. Uh, one second, guys. Yeah, once again, guys. Um, okay, good. It should work now, probably. Pepsi Okay, we're good. So, Hagiara currently in the corner. Trying to apply pressure. Yes, yeah, the opening. Ah, this is gonna do a hex ton of damage. Is that gonna kill? Absolutely not. But good stuff still. It's gonna be the Oki. Okay, using the IDM UA tournament. Good stuff. Oh, big jump in though from Caffeine. Gonna go for the cross up. Oh, Lord. Uh, tried to go for the playoff kicks, but... Wow, man, that tech, man, that was sick. Both really, really playing their heart out right now. Play <laughs> Oh, Lord, and Caffeine on tourney point. If Caffeine wins this one, it is going to be the end of the tournament, and the winner will be Caffeine. So let's see if I get a will permit it. Let's see how this pans out. Nice closest. Ooh, too far to get the grab, though. This is unfortunate. Get nice six. Oh lord. Ah, uh, the playoff kick. I get it with the playoff kick. Ah, uh, tried to go for the grab, but man, caffeine. Not letting him. Just throwing a minion in his general direction. Caffeine force pop the burst. Ooh, man, caffeine going from one side of the corner to the other. Just running. Oh, playoff kicks. Ah, uh, is that gonna kill? It is. I gotta say no. I'm not gonna let you win for free. Pepsi man! Okay. And back to the round. If Caffeine still takes this one, it is still tournament point. Okay, nice 2K 2D right there from Caffeine. Ooh, gets hit by the 6P though. That is very, very uh, interesting. Let's see how this spins out. 
Oh lord! I get up with the confirms! Illusion! Driver! Too far from the uh, corner to get the kill though. Not to get the wall break. Oh, we're getting here we go. Caffeine with the spacing. Yo, getting that knockdown. Oh, gets the grab! I get a gun on the pop the burst. Yep, he is. Oh lord. I get a doing, uh, Captain doing a good job of getting out of the corner to. Wow, that was so. Wow. <laughs> what did Caffeine do there? That was crazy. Man, we're going down to the last freaking game. These guys do not want to let me go to sleep, don't they? <laughs> good stuff, though. Damn, that is crazy, man. And on to the next and final battle. This is the absolute last match of tonight. If the one who wins this one will. Ah, uh, thanks, Scared, for the gift. The sub gift, much appreciated, man. And here we go with Caffeine. Oh, getting hit by the 2D camera. No. Let's see how this spins out. Ah, Caffeine trying to go for the air grab. See how this spins out. Good lord. Oof. Ah, oh, nice. A 2K 2D right there from Caffeine. Ah, gonna put that pressure on and on. Whew. Okay, let's see how this spins out. Here we go to 2K 2D. Nice grab from Hagera. Gonna get the side switch. This is gonna go down to the last round, isn't it? <laughs> nice grab from Hagera. Goes for the Roman cancel. And to the Legion Driver for guaranteed kill. Driver! Good stuff. Tournament points. Is Hagera gonna be able to take it? Or is Caffeine gonna be able to bring it back? Nice 2K 2D from Caffeine. Good lord. Ooh, that 2K 2D though. Good lord. Ooh, Caffeine. Caffeine trying to... Yeah, space with the 2K 2D right there. Gets air grab though. That was unfortunate because I'm sure he went for the same. And here we go. Oh, the wild reversal. I gotta using the minions to keep the pressure going. This is looking pretty bleak. Ah, not enough to kill though. Caffeine, Caffeine does have one bar stench and goes for the freaking Legend Driver on Wake Up. Not enough to kill though. And that being said, I got does have one as well. He goes for the ground and gets the kill. We are going down to the last round of the last smash, guys. This is the absolute last round of today's tournament. Who is going to take it? They're playing their hearts out, man. Good lord. Let's see how this spins out. Okay, Caffeine gets the first hit with the second hit as well. I get up really trying to take it as slowly as possible. Got the spins out. Good lord. Oh, to get to the job. Ja, I get it. Pop the burst first. He's in a pretty decent. Well, he is in a, not in an advantage, advantageous position because he doesn't have burst anymore. But he does have the corner position thing though, which can definitely make up for it if he uses his card to right. Unfortunately, he. Loses a bit of his uh, of his offense right there, offense potential, but still gets a lot of damage, a lot of chip damage thanks to it. But Caffeine still has his burst though, and Hagara definitely will not recoup, uh, will not keep uh, no more burst. And just like this, Hagara is actually in a, in a pretty, in, well, not so much advantage. And he just, oh, here we go with Hagara, trying to get the kill, and it's playoff time, kickoff time. Hagera trying to use the, uh, the the guard point, but yeah, Hagera not biting. Oh lord! Oh, that, that, that's so scary! And here we go. Oh, Caffeine trying to bait that grab though. Okay, gets the kill on the minion with the two the 2HS man is going. Oh, the grab! Hagera in the straight. Oh no, he almost got the jug. Oh no! Good lord! Good lord! Good lord! Good lord, what is this pressure? Six seconds, six seconds, four seconds to go. I gotta need to make something happen. Oh, what the hell? Oh, no, nah, are you serious? This is going to end on the time over. 